Uh, welcome yeah. back to the show. Thank, Thank you so you. much. Uh, every time you come on, we've we've talked about things. You don't even mean to say it on purpose, but something always happens with your phone. My phone is like my friend, and sometimes my foe. Yes. You know. Do you yeah. have any any new phone stories? Well, yeah. So. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, yeah. So you know, so you know my husband Bart, right? I love Bart. Yeah. So so we've we've been together for a long time, and so generally when we're in the car, we're we're we don't say much of anything. Stuff like you know, uh, ha traffic is terrible, or yeah. did you feed the dog, yeah. or is Lyme disease real? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That exactly. kind of you know, yeah, so it's really really yeah. nothing. But this one time we were in the car, and we were on this kind of this long car ride, and and we just started talking very explicitly about somebody's divorce. About oh my God, they got divorced and yeah, oh the yeah, money and the house and then what happened? Do you know what happened? I don't know. Blah, blah, blah. I, back and forth and back and forth and so for like, for uh, for for quite a while and I, I looked down at my phone and I, I realized that I'd recorded it, um, but not that I, not not only I recorded I recorded that voice thing that you send when someone texts you because oh. someone yes. So somebody had texted us. They text us both on a group text, yeah, right? Yeah, no, I don't and like this thought, thing. No, I don't so, like that. So they text us, and I looked down, and, and it, was, it, it was sending. And it was like, and I said, oh, my God, Bart, I, I recorded this, and it's sending. It's like going, but it's not quite going. I, it doesn't like, make what, that what sound, I but I know what you're talking about, yeah. No, I know what you're talking about, yeah, because like, the line's about to hit the end, like, and it's like this. Mission Impossible. Right, right. It's like, yeah. dum, 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 <laughs> don't send it! <laughs> dum, dum, <laughs> cut the blue wire! Yeah. So, so, um, so he's like, turn off your phone. Yes. Turn off the phone. We're like, what are we going to do? What are we going to do? Oh. Like, oh, um, okay. Oh, oh my no. God. And so then he pulls over and, and tries to Google, can you delete uh, a voicemail? <laughs> Wait, who and is it going course, to? Do you know who it's going to? I, I know. Well, it's going to a just third a party. It's going to just somebody who's oh. making dinner plans with us. Maybe they didn't figure out what exact words. Come well, they, they mess those things. I didn't want her to hear it either because then, and so, so he, we couldn't, found out we couldn't delete it. And then I'm like, well, I'm just going to have to call her and like beg her not to listen to it. What are we going to do? So let's, let's drive home. Of course they're going to listen to it. Well, yes, of course. Who wouldn't? I would. Yeah. Yes. I mean, I said, oh, of course so, I won't, Julianne. So like, we, get, we get home. <laughs> <laughs> but maybe maybe the the text isn't what you isn't, actually said. Yes, well that's what we so then we get then we get home and our our 17 year old daughter is there and she and we're at, we're frantic and we tell her the story and she's like oh my god I'm weak. <laughs> <laughs> wait so, I'm weak. So I said wait a minute wait a minute I said let's <laughs> let's weak. try to listen to it to see if it even recorded because sometimes it could be like oh yeah you butt out yeah, you butt somebody. You butt out somebody you can't hear anything so we start to listen to it and it's clear as a bell. Oh my it's goodness! It's like it's like as if we had lav mics on us the entire time. <laughs> yeah. oh so she she's and then at that point she's like I'm dead I'm dead. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm, I'm, like, I'm dead I'm weak. What are we gonna do? And so and so uh, she's like put your phone in airplane mode. And so we do that, and then she goes, you can go to a place where you don't get any service and it won't send. But we have to figure out where it is that we won't get any service. So we're like, Liv, where do you and your friends go? She's like, well, there's this one place. <laughs> <laughs> and, so, and so we're like, oh, okay, all right, let's go, let's go. And we get in the car and we're like, it's like sweating. And I'm like, and like I said, I don't want to call the person and say, please don't listen. And we, we drive to the end of the road and he takes my phone and his phone because, of course, it was a group text. So he'll know if he gets the message, whether it's sent. Everyone's in trouble, yeah. So I just sit in the car and I, as he goes to this place and, and wait and look out the window like a dog in the wrong direction <laughs> for like 15 minutes. Yeah. And, uh, and he comes back in this direction like, Mission accomplished! Yes! <laughs> we did not send the text! We did not send the text! Like, like, thank God! Thank God! Uh, so, so now I'm always trying to figure out how to disable my phone whenever I'm in the car because I'm afraid I'm going to... I learned my now lesson. On, yeah. just to, I should just talk about the dog. Uh, speaking of your husband, yeah. uh, uh, Bart Freund, like, uh, one of the, he's a great writer-director. Yeah. Uh, you guys did this film together after yeah. the wedding. Yeah. Is yeah. this the fourth time you've worked together? It is the as... fourth time. Yeah, we actually met on a movie 23 years ago. I love that guy. Yeah. Please tell me to say hello. I will. He's so Absolutely. talented and fantastic. He is uh, great. Did you always great. know that you were going to do this film? Well, it kind of it, the movie came to him. It was it's based on a Danish movie the same the same name um, that was made about 12 years ago, and they came to him to do an American adaptation, and and it originally starred two men, and so he was kind of wondering how he's like, if you're going to do this beautiful movie again, how would he? What's his interpretation of it? And um, 
he's decided to switch the genders, so then I got a part. <laughs> <laughs> uh, and you, yeah, and it's a, it's it's a tricky movie. It's beautifully it's a very done. Tricky movie, yeah, There's so many yeah. things I don't want to spoil anything because you it should just watch it. It's Michelle Williams, who's absolutely wonderful, and Billy Crudup, who's equally wonderful, and a yeah. young a young actress named Abby Quinn. And it's a family drama, and there are lots and lots of surprises. It's very emotional, and um, I really love it. And I think it sort of speaks to all of us because it's about who do you love you know yeah all right here we go uh this is uh, after the wedding take a look mm -hmm. this is um it's great i mean it's very very impressive thank you the work that you're doing i i feel that i need a little more time to explore this there are a lot of very deserving organizations out there what i'm sorry i was under the impression that you had already decided to be involved if you look at the information there, you can see that the need is undeniable. Clearly, I just have, um, I have a big weekend ahead of me, so why don't you leave all this with me, and we'll have lunch on Monday, and I'll tell you what I can do. But in the meantime, come to the wedding, and we can get to know each other better. I have a flight to India. Well, you know, staying the weekend won't kill you. Gwen! Gwen, can you get Isabel an invitation to the wedding? Right away. And you won't be uncomfortable. It, I promise you, it's just a big party. It'll be fun. Julianne Moore, everybody! And it's on and on and on.